why does Israel want to rule the world? Answer Because Al Masih al Dajjal, in order for the Jews to accept his claim that he is indeed the true Messiah, he must rule the world from Jerusalem, from a state of Israel. Otherwise, nobody is going to believe him. In order for the Jews to believe that this is indeed the true Messiah, the Jal, he's got to get rid of this bogus paper money. Every Jew knows that this is bogus, this is fraudulent, this is haram. Uh, maybe the Muftis will know it tomorrow. And Israel has to bring back gold and silver as money. If Israel does not have gold and silver as money, no Jew will accept this man as the Messiah. And so the world is going to come back to gold and silver as money. You're not going to get this in any textbook of international monetary economics, no. No university in the world will tell you this, no. The days of tomorrow which is coming in which mankind are going to turn back to gold and silver as money. Uh, even Malaysia. And you're not going to have your ringgit anymore. No university is going to tell you that. How do we know it? Because we turn to the Quran and we turn to Nabi Muhammad alayhi salatu wasalam. If Israel is to rule the world, then Israel will have to begin by ruling the Arab world. I'm sure you'll agree with me. Israel will have to subdue the Arabs. Israel will have to establish an Israeli political and economic dominion over the Arab world because that's the beginning of ruling the world and so now we're beginning to see some light now that we have understood from our Islamic eschatological perspective El Mu'akhir al-Zaman that Israel wants to rule the world we know that Israel will have to subdue the Arabs.